Okay. I think it's going. Confirm that it's going. It might take a second. Hi, everybody out there in internet land. We got the okay? Cool. We are up and live. Welcome, everybody, back again to another Short Shenanigans show. My name is Andrew Silver, and this is going to be a weird, fun time where I basically make a fool out of myself for entertainment, which is always a lot of fun. Uh, I am here situated in my basement at the moment. You might be able to hear the heater. I apologize about that. Hopefully that isn't too much of an issue in audio, but we're gonna go with it anyway, because that's what live theater is all about. Uh, all about. So I'm here down in my basement because we are all uh, stuck inside at the moment uh, because of the conditions of the world at the moment, but I figured that is no reason to stop us from having a little bit of entertainment and joy in our homes, uh, because why not? Keep the performance arts alive, uh, keep entertainment alive, and uh, we can all gather around together on the internet. <laughs> so that's why we're here. That's why we're, I'm doing this show. Uh, that's why Kayla is here helping me. Thank you, Kayla, for uh, monitoring the comments. If you have any comments or ideas or suggestions for things I can do to try and uh, uh, balance or juggle or just generally uh, clown around, please feel free to uh, leave a little comment uh, below and we're going to try to get to those comments today. If not, then I read them all and we will try to get to them uh, next time. So if you enjoyed what I'm about to do here today, if you enjoyed this show, if it put a smile on your face, if it made your day a little bit brighter um, and you feel like showing your appreciation, I do have a little uh, donation button right on the homepage of my website, uh, andrewsilver.com, which is also right here, um, Andrew Silver Variety Artists. AndrewSilver.com. So if you feel like donating a little something, no pressure, but if you do, uh, the donation button is right on the homepage. With all that being said, let's get started with this uh, episode of the Short Shenanigans Show. Uh, we are going to be taking some suggestions for, from comments in the last episode. First one uh, was forks. Again, I know we've done forks last time. And actually, now that the thing's off, I'm going to turn this down a little bit. Ah, there you go. I don't feel like I have to be as loud. Okay, good. So uh, last week, or last time I did this, uh, I had to do forks, but we got another suggestion. Apparently that wasn't good enough, so I'm going to have to do three forks at the same time now. <laughs> so I'll, I'll bring you through my uh, thought process on this. I'm going to try to connect them as best as I can. I'm going to do this little maneuver. I'm sure you've all seen or done this similar thing before. I'm then going to lock them into place with this one, ah, just like that. Perfect. Okay. And I know it's off kilter here because there's only three. They said three, not four. I would have preferred four, but we're going to do three. All right. I'm going to see if I can balance this right here. All right. <laughs> three forks balanced on the face. Here we go. Whoa. This is going to be harder than I thought. <laughs> All right. Maybe the nose would be easier. Let's try the nose. Oh. oh, oh, that was better. That was better. I think we can get even better though. Let's try one last time. I think the nose was good. Let's keep going with that. Oh yeah, there it is. Three forks on the face. Yes, good. Okay. And if I see four forks on there, well actually four forks might be okay. We'll see. We'll see how crazy the comments go with forks. Uh, before I get to the next suggestion, uh, one thing that was in the comments of the last video was someone jokingly said, Andrew, could you please balance my finances? And while that may be a little difficult, I, I want to try to juggle some numbers, do a little bit of um, impressive mental math for you. So here's what I'm going to do. I want a random number. Uh, somewhere below 100, because above 100 gets really, really crazy. Uh, but maybe above 20, because below that is just too easy and I want a challenge. So if Anybody who wants can throw into the comment section any number between 20 and 100, and whatever number comes up first, Kayla's going to be relaying it to me. I'm going to try to do uh, an incredible mental, mathematical magic trick uh, for you with that number. So go ahead, put in your comments. In the meantime, I'm going to go on to the next thing. Cool. What was that? Oh, we already have one. 47. 42. 42. 42. Well, okay, you know what? Let's do that first. I don't want you to think that I've had time to think about it. So we're gonna do, 42 is a good number, by the way. I appreciate whoever put that in, <laughs> nice. Okay, so we're gonna take the number uh, 42, 
Here, can you see? Can you see this? Is this something you can see? Is the light too intense for you? Huh? Is that better? We'll go with that. Yeah? Can you see that? <laughs> sure. Okay. So I'm just gonna start throwing in some numbers here. Uh, let's go with that. Uh, let's go with this here. Uh, we're gonna go here. This. Uh, you know what? No, 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 not, not there. Here. Uh, here. Let's go here and this and uh, this one. Okay, getting there, getting there. All right, um, 42, huh? 42, 42, 42. Uh, okay, let's see, and uh, let's go here, and uh, here. Okay, do I, did I miss anyone? One, there we go. Uh, oh, here, sorry, let's put this in as well. Okay, all right, time, <laughs> 42. I think I did this okay. I tried to fill in all the numbers as fast as I could. Um, let's do a little bit of mental math together here. So we have uh, 5 plus 4 is 9, plus 11 is 20, plus 22 is 42. Excellent. Uh, next one, 1 uh, plus, oh, did I get this one? Plus 1, uh, you know what, let's, oh, I messed up. I might have made this an 8. 1 plus 8 is 9, uh, plus 10 is 19, plus 23 is 42. Whew. Okay, 12 plus 21 plus 3 plus 6 is 42. Don't believe me, check the math. 7 plus 2 plus 24 plus 9 is 42. I know, and it gets crazier. All of these equal 42, but 1 plus 12 equals 13, plus 7 equals 20, plus 22 equals 42. 11 plus 21 plus 2 plus 8 equals 42. 3 plus 5 plus 10 plus 24 equals 42. 42, it's all 42. You can check it, ladies and gentlemen. 42, all the way across the board. We have made a magic square. Whew, lots of mental math. Try this at home. Uh, see if you can get something similar to this. Here we go. Actually, you know what? Everyone try the number 37. I dare you. Send me a picture of you trying the number 37 with this same idea. Uh, I'd love to see what you <laughs> have in store. So there it is, the magic square. I didn't quite uh, balance your finances, but I did do a little, uh, a little bit of uh, number juggling. <laughs> so I hope you all enjoyed that. Ooh, man, that was a tough one. All right, I did the best I could. So here we go. Uh, before we get to the next thing, actually, I just was uh, wanted everyone to comment in, this, in the comment section what you're doing with your time during all of this. What things are you doing to keep creative, keep yourselves busy? I'm doing this. So I'd love to hear what you're doing at home as well. Uh, build a bit of community, you know, uh, as we keep going. So <laughs> next thing, uh, we had a suggestion for... Mountain Dew, not just, uh, not just specifically Mountain Dew, any soda, but specifically a partially um, empty <laughs> soda bottle, which makes this like 20 times harder. I don't know if you have ever tried to balance anything on your face, but uh, half full water bottles or soda bottles is really difficult because the liquid sloshes around and it's just a pain in the butt. And we're going to try it anyway. So here we go. Half empty Mountain Dew soda bottle on the face. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I can feel the liquid sloshing around. <laughs> oh gosh, okay. Here we go. Wait for the liquid to get a little bit more still. There we go. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Attempt number one. That's fine. Let's try to get it a little bit longer. as well as I hoped it would. We're good! <laughs> that went right up my nose. Okay. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Last chance. Here we go with the Mountain Dew on the face. Oh, okay, good. That's a success. I got Mountain Dew on me now. Time to take a shower after this. <laughs> we got it. All right. What's next? I hope you're all enjoying this. I certainly am. <laughs> okay, next thing uh, is gonna be even harder, I know. Uh, we are going to try to balance a single sheet of paper 
eight and a half by 11 on my face. Now you could do it the easy way. You could do it uh, boop, like that, but that's not entertaining, is it? Okay, here we go. This is probably the hardest thing I've done yet today. I'm gonna try to just crease it just a little bit here. Not too much, we're gonna keep it straight. I'm gonna see if I can balance this right on the tip of my nose. Here we go, eight and a half by 11 piece of paper. Oh. There it is, oh, oh God, it's going down, it's going down. <laughs> nice. All right, that wasn't bad, huh? Okay, really? Okay, it looks like we've gotten 10 minutes out of the way already. I wasted a lot of time with that Mountain Dew, I'll tell you what. Okay, good. So that is an eight and a half by 11 piece of paper. Let's try that one more time. Oh yeah, nice. That's much better, look at that, such control. All right, good, <laughs> nice. You have right. people commenting what they're doing first. Oh, I'd love, to, I'd love to hear what people are doing. What are people doing? Um, one of the comments was drinking wine. Drinking Lots wine. Of it in the UK lockdown. Yeah, well, yeah, uh, I'm sure the entire world is kind of on lockdown at the moment. Uh, happy um, to have some people from the UK watching this live stream. Thanks, everybody from the UK and all across the world. Uh, happy to have you here. Uh, any last, any, one, I'll take one another more. Another one is um, someone's son said, learning to ride my bike with no training wheels. Oh, that's awesome. You know what, maybe next time I'm gonna whip out my unicycle and we can train together. Uh, I, I've got a few less wheels, but that's okay. Training is good. Uh, get up there. When you fall off, keep getting back on. That's certainly what I had to do in learning how to ride the unicycle, but good on you for learning how to ride without training wheels. That's awesome. Keep up the good work. We're gonna move right along here. Uh, we don't have a ton of time left, but uh, one last thing that I definitely wanted to do uh, was I did want to bring back out my juggling knives. Now, I've, I, I did juggle these in the last show, uh, so if you'd like to go see that, all of the shows that I've done already are in uh, on my page. Uh, scroll down and you'll see all of them. And I'm gonna start posting them uh, to YouTube as well, so you'll be able to see them there. But I'm taking these back out because I wanted to see if I could juggle them. I'm gonna place them right here to start. I wanted to see if I could juggle them while also riding a Rollabola. Ooh, excellent, very good. A Rollabola is a uh, large piece of PVC or plastic piping here. And on top of that is going to be a big piece of wood. And on top of that is gonna be me. So we have the Rollabola, we have the piece of wood right here. And then we need to put me on top of it. So let's see if I can even get on this thing. Here we go, roll a bola, and go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we are on top of the roll a bola. Okay, and now I need the juggling knives. So I didn't think this through. All right, that's fine, I can get it. I can get it, don't worry. Okay, maybe not that hand. Oh, I got one! Okay. Okay, here's one. How are we feeling with one? Okay. Good. Not that bad. <laughs> Number two. Here we go. <laughs> Alright. Almost got it. Almost got it. Got it! Two! Okay. We got two juggling knives. How are we feeling about this? Good, juggling knife, good, good, okay. Feeling pretty good with two. Last one, the third one. Here we go. How do I pick them up with the, okay. <laughs> Give me a second. You know what, here we go. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay, trying this again. Can, can you see the juggling knife on the floor in front of me? No, cool. It's far away from where I am right now. That's, oh, okay. Got it, we're gonna get this. Oh, I got it, okay, we're good. Whew. All right, that's one, two, three juggling knives on top of the Rollabola. Here we go, time to juggle all three. In three, two, one, cool. Yeah, now. I have spent a lot of time getting good at this. 
This is not something you should try at home. However, I, although I've gotten really good at getting started with this, one thing I have not practiced as much is stopping. So, <laughs> we're gonna try to do that anyway. Here we go. Gonna stop any second now. Right now. Now. <laughs> now. <laughs> okay? Another plan. New plan. We're just gonna jump off. In three, two, one, go! Woo! Whoa! Alright! We did it! <laughs> I'm alive! Alright. Good stuff. How's everybody doing out there in comment land? Um, Hope you're enjoying the show. A lot of people didn't want you to do the knives thing. There's a lot of Too late. do it, don't do it, stop, no. Too late. <laughs> Goodness. Uh, how long do we got? Do we have time for one more thing? And, so, I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay, good. Let's one do one more thing. Yeah. Alright, I am going to juggle some more. Uh, but so far I've been juggling all of the same object. Um, I have some juggling clubs here, and I also have my cane. I'm going to try to juggle these three things at the same time, and then we're going to have a big finish. So here we go. Alright, cool. Okay, two juggling clubs, one cane, and three, two, one, whoo, whoo, whoa, okay, nice. This is made especially difficult because of the low ceiling, but we're doing it, nice. Not too bad. So here's the big finish. I will attempt, if I can, to throw the juggling, one of the juggling clubs into the air and catch it using only the cane. None, not my hands, just the cane, if I can. So here we go, big finale. In three, two, one, go! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, yeah! Wow, that almost didn't work out. Nice! Well, all right. <laughs> we did it! Good stuff. So we have the uh, club in the cane as the big finale. Uh, that brings us, I guess, to the end of this show. We still got a bunch of stuff planned. Uh, <laughs> for the next episode already. We didn't get a chance to do some of the stuff I wanted to do today, but that's okay. We're gonna be doing it in the next episode. Now, if this put a smile on your face, or maybe a look of shock on your face while I was doing the knife thing, and you wanna show your appreciation, uh, I would appreciate that. Keep the arts alive, keep uh, performing arts uh, going in Maine and in the world. Um, and if you'd like to uh, put a little donation onto my homepage, the link uh, is on the description of this video. Uh, and it's also just andrewsilver.com, so pretty easy to remember. And uh, that all being said, I guess let me see if there's anything I wanted to mention else, uh, anything else I wanted to mention today. I guess not. I hope everyone's having an awesome day today. I hope you're staying happy and healthy at home. Please continue to wash your hands. Stay away from people. Uh, keep having a good time watching these streams, uh, and we will see you next time. Thanks, everybody. Have a good day.